With the find function in Excel, you can find a specific character or text string within text and you can also specify a starting position within that text. Find is case sensitive, so if case is not important, you could use the search function instead. For our first example, we'll just see how it works. So here's the cell with the text that we're going to search, and we're looking for a capital I, and by using the find function, looking in cell B2 for the text that is in B5, it shows that the first capital I is found at position 14. So you can see there are other lowercase i's before that, so it finds the first capital I. You can also use if error around the find function, so that if it doesn't find the letter you're looking for, it won't just return an error, it will show not found. So if error is available in Excel 2007 and later. And in this example, we have ID numbers and valid codes that we're looking for within those ID numbers. And it's case sensitive again. So by using the find function within this formula that has other functions, it will look for the exact string of characters that's in the valid code column. It will return a number if it finds that string. And so we're using if around that to report whether it found that string or not. This function is array entered. So when I finish typing the formula on the keyboard, I press control shift and enter, and it automatically puts those curly brackets at the start and end. And in the final example, we're using find again to look for the first space within this string. We want to get rid of the street numbers if they're in the address and just return the text that follows the numbers. So we're looking for the first space character with the find function. And we're checking first to see if the first character at the left is a number. And if it is, we'll use the find function to, to find where that first space after the number is and return the rest. And if there is no number at the start, it will just return the full text from column B.